Metasploit has a number of auxiliary modules that can be used to scan target systems for unique vulnerabilities. To access the Metasploit framework, type MSF console from the command line. Then we'll use the search command to look for various auxiliary scanners. So we'll enter search scanner. Here we have an X11 scanner that scans to identify if the X11 service can be accessed with no authentication. Now we know from an earlier scan of our Metasploitable system that the X11 service is running on it. To verify this, we'll do a real quick in-map scan against port 6000. So we'll enter nmap-p, specify the port 6000, and then the IP address. Now that we've verified that the X11 service is running on port 6000 of our Metasploitable machine, We'll copy the path for the auxiliary scanner. Then we'll use the use command to access the module. Then we'll enter show options to see the different configurations for the scanner. And then we want to set our host or remote host to the IP address of our target system. Then show options once again to verify that the change was made. And as you can see, the remote host IP address has been updated. And then use run to execute the auxiliary scanner. Now in this case, our first test failed with an access denied. So we have verified that that vulnerability does not exist on the system. Now we'll search for vulnerabilities associated with FTP. So here we'll grab the auxiliary FTP anonymous checker and this will check to see if anonymous access can be granted to the FTP service. We'll enter the use command followed by the path of the auxiliary scanner and then show options to see the different configurations and once again we need to configure the R host. So we'll use set remote host and then we'll specify the IP address of both our metasploitable machine separated by a comma, and then the IP address of our XP machine. Both of these systems are running the FTP service. Then show options again, and here we can verify that the remote host was updated. And then run. The results indicate that not only is anonymous access available on both of these FTP services, but it also identifies the FTP service running on each. So those are just a few examples of how you can use Metasploit auxiliary modules to identify vulnerabilities on a target system. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night, I raise my hand.